What's up winners? This is awful crazy stuff. Thank you anonymous fan from India for sending this to me uh, and pointing out, oh, just look at this. So this is Harry and Meghan helping parents who've lost their children uh, to the worst possible thing. And um, like, look, look at Meghan's face. You know, they're just it's loving the attention. With Prince Harry Watch. and Meghan Markle. How do you see the healing community? It it Look at her play at work. elation. You observed it. Uh, from my perspective, they, oh. have their, they have their groups that we help to convene, but then it's what they do when those groups aren't in session, mm -hmm. how they spend holidays together, how they become <laughs> Thanksgiving together, how they become... Mm. Mumbles. We were able to help plant a bit of a seed. Why are they... Is she talking? right why not to pair like it's just a way to get tension and anonymous pointed this out and has a great point it's an online community this is they have millions of dollars uh millions that they haven't claimed from the archwell foundation the pr firm the tax evasion allegedly um it's totally ridiculous an online community I, I can make an online community like literally there's all these platforms like 50 bucks a month 100 bucks a month you didn't do anything for these parents so they use they gave the absolute minimum investment minimum anything in order to get the maximum exposure just the minimal thing they could do they're to pretend that they're doing them. something but if there's a need for it you're watching it grow and the expansion of that I think has been very powerful, especially because they all come from such different walks of life. Mm. So when things can feel so polarized or disconnected, you go, these are people that at face value you would think have absolutely nothing in common. And the pain of what you... What is wrong with her? I Hold on. It's a sad and a devastating truth. No, no, that's fake. Right before that, polarized, she's like... Connected, you go, these are people that at face value you would think have absolutely nothing in common. And you know, you think that like, like, you know what it is? She doesn't know what script she should be following in the moment. What fakeness, right? Just using cliches. I mean, there are people that you would think have nothing in common, but then you find out that their children are past and, oh wait, oh, that's serious. Uh, right? Like awful, awful, Megan, awful. Look at Mumbles McGee. The pain oh, of what unites them is a sad and a devastating truth. Look at him. Truth Look at Harry's. And yet, through that, they've found deeper connection with each other. So, I think that's one oh, that's of so the great. things is being able to say maybe they're they're more alike in so many ways than they are different, which is a good reminder for all of us. When you were oh, th thanks, Megan, for preaching. But also, I think that's like already kind of low class. Like, I don't know, like. It's such a serious issue. Like, oh, they seem so different. Like, like, why do you have to even, like, make them different? You know what I mean? You know what? I, I know why. Ego, right? She's like, these people seem so different and they could never get along. But me, I came in and we made a forum for, like, $20 a month and used them for millions of dollars worth of PR. And, like, now they can connect. I mean, all these people are, like, discriminatory against each other, but I fixed it. Like, what? You're really talking them down right like like why do you need to like like who said that they had to all be different and separated only megan um, right they didn't say that severely depressed at the time i think you were pregnant all the uh, this lady sucks you were, and how did harry react oh he's a and yet look you at, were uh -huh. reluctant to tell your husband look at harry you didn't know how he would react mm -hmm. and how did harry react oh he's a very loving husband. Okay. I could say this about Harry, I guess. You know what his body language is reminding me of? What was it? Coco the gorilla that learned sign language? Seriously. I'm not kidding. Like, I'm not kidding. Look, uh, if I have time, maybe I could overlay Coco the gorilla. You didn't know how he would react. And how did Harry right? react? Look. Oh, he's a very loving husband so i'm here i think you know what you're saying to the me way really she says that is so patronizing that you'll have more time with do you know what it takes for them to talk about this experience and how brave they 
you know what it takes for them? <laughs> I mean, their, their kids fast, but I mean, you know what it's like to be able for me to talk to the camera and use this issue so that people can't criticize me? <laughs> I want to talk about this experience for other families mm. and other parents and to relive really that Gross, grief, disgusting person. But to do it in such a purpose-driven way to help save other children, it, that's... That's the piece that I think the heck for us it? when we look at this work and why we're so committed to it is because we recognize what it takes for them to put themselves out there in this way and really applaud that so that we can help, why? Them, help them champion whatever change why? needs to be made. And, and these, these parents, they're, they're not the same parents. All right, Mumbles McGee, we're, we're going to listen to him for a second, but the change that needs to be made is no one can say anything that Megan doesn't like. I think that's all it is. It's a way to get attention, and it's a way to use this as a vehicle, right? So Megan doesn't want people to be able to say things that she doesn't like, right? And you can't just say that, like, meh. But what she can say, and, you know, to get rid of free speech, but what she can say is, oh, what, you know, people saying things I don't like, that harms children, Oh, do you want to harm children? Oh, well then, uh, no, then you can't speak against it, right? We, we see it's like these Trojan horses. This is pretty common in modern times. Watch out for this, right? We see it pretty commonly where they just use, it, use something to make it very hard to argue against their issue. And they often use children for it, not just Meghan and Harry. Two, year, two years ago, mm -hmm. right? They've, they've, they've gained in confidence. They've, they've been through and are still going through their own personal healing process. And they have each other now. But they have each other. And that's that's what makes <laughs> Megan looks sad now that Harry's talking and she's not. She doesn't have a relation. Um question for my English viewers. I know there's different accents. They're like more posh. Like to me William, Catherine, they have a good accent. The Queen obviously. Does Harry have it? Like does he have it and then it's just not clear? Because to me he doesn't sound like very posh compared to like other royals and and stuff like that maybe just because he's such not a clear speaker let me know i'm curious